Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. If you're a new subscriber or a new viewer, hey, welcome. Hit the subscribe button and be a part of the Braddy Gang. And if you're a returning subscriber or viewer, hey babe, thanks for coming back. Um, so today is going to be uh, part two of my inventory um, vlog. I have a lot to get through today. Um, I didn't plan on having all of this in this video, but hey, you know, we're going to... We're going to get through it. I'm trying to get through it quickly. Um, I have another part to this. I'm going to upload right after this. Um, and that part is just going to be strictly... It's still going to be like an inventory vlog. It's going to be just about one part. Okay? If you've never seen any of my entrepreneurial videos, any of my entrepreneurial blogs, everything will be linked down below. And throughout the video, I'll have different links pop up. So you can watch um, my entrepreneur series when I talk about steps to becoming an entrepreneur, I mean starting a business, uh, you know, with your name, your logo, questions and, and research and stuff you need to do and certain things you need to know. And part two of my entrepreneur series was all about vendors, how to find a vendor, all of that. Like I, I really went into detail with vendors and I also showed you how to find vendors. Um, as well as, um, as well as I talked about a specific vendor. In the last video, I did um, show you guys my business cards, my thank you cards. However, um, I didn't like the way how it turned out as far as like my borders were off and stuff like that. So I ended up contacting Vistaprint. They fixed it and they shipped it out. Shipped out um, a new set of thank you cards, a new set of business cards. So now I have a thousand business cards and a thousand thank you cards um the only difference is is that my border still isn't a hundred percent correct but it is better than it was so this is my thank you card um i did ask them to make it small i had the five by seven the first time so now i have the four by six and which works out because I do have smaller bubble millers that these could fit in. And then I'll use the other ones. Um, although they're messed up, I'm just still going to use it because I don't want to waste it. I mean, it's 500 you know? And then, same thing with my business card. Like, this is my business card. I have the UV rays, so you basically can feel it. And then this is the back of my business card. Um... I did design my business card and my thank you cards. I did ask in my last video if you guys... No, I didn't ask in the video. I put it in a comment. Um, so I'm going to ask in this video. <laughs> if you guys want to see me... Um, if you guys want me to upload a video on how I designed my business cards and thank you cards. Or to show you guys how to design them and places where you can get them printed off. Um, let me know in the comments. And then I will film that video for you guys. I just didn't want to film it. Because it is a tedious process. And then, you know, you guys didn't want to see it. So, one of the things I had to open just to make sure that the sizes were right. When I go to um, order my next size boxes. Or our black boxes. Okay, so let me start off saying. My business is called... Because I have never told y'all what my business was called. I'm, um, you know what I'm selling if you watch my previous videos. Okay, so my business is called Pretty and Ruthless Luxury Playhouse. Um, it's a background behind my name. I will go into detail in the video when I go to launch. I explain my name. Um, but basically, I will be selling lashes. Uh, for my launch, lashes and lip glosses. Um. And I have a few other things I want to launch. I'm just not going to say it until it's time to launch. Um, I have not come up with a launch date yet. But it will be within the next couple of weeks. I just have to... I don't know. I think I just... I keep procrastinating with my launch date. Because I think I'm nervous and anxiety is starting to set in. And a little fear. I don't know why. Because I was excited before. I'm still excited. I'm just a little scared. But anyway, so... The colors of my brand, my main color is black. Yes. 
the black foxes um throughout this process i have definitely changed the amount of pink white and silver i wanted originally in my um brand but my main color is black so everything is just supposed to be black 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 it was supposed to have a touch of pink touch of silver touch of white right and they kind of work out like that throughout but i you know i'm growing to accept <laughs> that some things are going to change so these are my black boxes and these this is it put together i just need to see the size so that when i do order more i can know what size to get and if i wanted to keep that particular size oh <gasps> y'all this has been an, an annoying situation okay these are all my oils make sure that when you get your oils you check to make sure that it the top is screwed on tight because one of my oils it came sealed but it was kind of like the seal the seal is broken so this particular oil has been leaking and as you can see it just leaks like so just just make sure that if you do oil um order your oils offline that you get to make sure that uh um that everything is sealed oh my gosh y'all this is so cute <laughs> i like little stuff i don't know but this is so cute it's a, it's a let me see if you can see it it's just a little dropper okay and these are my flavoring oils for my lip gloss um i did not expect them to be this size you're gonna hear probably hear that a lot throughout this video um i am i don't know i i have been really bad with measurements and stuff so again i didn't expect them to be this size especially for the price that i paid for them um and the crazy thing is, like, right before I ordered it, because um, I tend to put a lot of stuff in my cart, you just leave it. So right before I ordered it, it was, like, a price, and then it increased literally the day before I ordered it, $10. And now that I'm looking at it, I'm just like, why are you playing with me? <laughs> like, do not play with me. Why is this the size? Like, I gen... Oh! I genuinely expected these to be bigger than this. This is this is a joke. But these are the Loran um, flavor and oil size. I don't really care about my lip gloss actually having a taste. Um, more than I'm concerned that it actually has the correct smell that I want. I've been seeing people talk about. I guess that's why you taped it like that. I've been seeing people talk about um, how how when they use these oils that they can't taste it, and <laughs> she'll probably get me. But I'm not a person who eats my lip gloss, but I know people who do. Like my sister, she likes. <laughs> She's right, go get me for that. But she likes to like eat her lip gloss if it tastes good or whatever. So, you know, if you're one of those people, um, yeah, I don't think that's gonna <laughs> be the case with my lip glosses. They're gonna smell good, but as far as taste good, yeah, I don't, I don't eat my lip glosses, so I don't know why I wouldn't, you know. these are my pigment well some of my pig pigments these are just samples i wanted to see like the actual color payoff and then i ended up ordering bigger sizes and if you know tkb uh 
processing time has been bananas since COVID-19 and all of this stuff started. Um, so I wanted to get that as early as possible so I can check out the colors and then I was going to, well I did order the bigger sizes. I didn't want to bring the big, cause I didn't want to bring the big part out of here, like transfer because I already had to bring all of this stuff out here. Um, but if you are shipping big boxes, you're a business owner and you're shipping big boxes, I hope you know that you can get free shipping supplies from USPS. So what I ordered, um, I mean what I did was went ahead and ordered uh, three different sh um, three different pieces and it's free. I mean, if this is, all you have to do is create a business account and yeah that's all you have to do create a business account and then you have to ship it to your house for free i know you can um go pick it up from the post office but if i were you i would just order it <laughs> so they can bring it to your door um so what i got was i got a big pack of these these are the the nine these are the 9.5 by 12.5 bubble mailers, priority bubble mailers, and then I have the medium flat rate box as well as the large flat rate box. So it's cool to have, like, I mean, it's, it's okay, especially if, if you don't mind paying extra to have um, custom packaging, but when you start shipping like big packages your prices are going to go up so you know anything about priority if it fit the ships and with the flat rate the flat rate um boxes and envelopes it ended up costing you less in the long run um for bigger stuff smaller stuff I would definitely use custom pack. We're well, not even custom packages, but you know, regular bubble meals and stuff. So this bag, right? I got a bad habit of showing y'all my um, address. Oh, and by the way, if you want to see the tutorial on this eye look, it'll be up before or after this, and I will have it linked above and below. Okay. Okay. So <clears throat> I already showed you guys my. Um, lip gloss tools in my last inventory unboxing I was determined to have silver top squeeze tools I didn't care what it cost as long as the quality was right I was determined to have them so I have uh, I ordered a um, bulk of those people that um not even well if you guys to the other um lip gloss business owners <laughs> that who wash their tools before they put their products in them so specifically to speaking to you guys because I've seen some videos of people who didn't wash their tools just got it out of the box put it in. so to the people who wash their tools before they sell them um, do y'all have any recommendations on um, how to try them because my method of drying my tubes is, is a very um, long process. And I don't want to continue doing it like that. <laughs> if you guys have any recommendations, please let me know. Okay. This package right here just have multiple oils. I mean, more oils. Um, I don't... I don't think I need to tell y'all what oils I'm using. I'm pretty sure, like, if you use lip gloss, then, I mean, if you make lip gloss, then, you know. <laughs> you, yeah. It's one of them situations, if you, if you know, you know. Okay, so the, this package is the, um, the Ultra Fine Glitter from Hemway. Um, they have these on Amazon. I ended up ordering it from their actual site. Um, 
I want to show you guys how it looks. I'll probably take a video and actually insert a clip on how to find the... This glitter leaks. It, it falls everywhere. But I want to show you guys how fine the actual glitter is because on Amazon and on their website, it doesn't really show you like how, like really how the glitter looks. So I want to show you guys that um, for the people who were curious on... The people who are curious on how their glitter looks, because I know this is a popular brand on Amazon, but like I said, if you've never ordered it, if you've never ordered it and you wanted to see like how fine the glitter is, I can I'm gonna actually try to put it like in a cup or something to show you. And it's cosmetic grade. So for all you makeup lovers, um these will be safe to use. Okay. Why? Stuff. This is what I, I mean, I understand it comes from different uh, companies, but these big behind envelopes for stuff this small is so ridiculous to me. It is super ridiculous. What is it? These are my um my edible gold flakes, my goalie. I know, see, size, y'all, size. Because if I told y'all what I paid for this little thing that's not even full, <sighs> pay attention to the size. Good thing I already have a different one in my um, cart. What a These are my organic dried lavender flowers. And this is one. Yeah. And then this is my organic dry chamomile. This light is just... Oh, it's kind of cute, you know? <laughs> Another big package for this small thing. What is this? Oh. This is my chunky glitter. I ordered this from the same company, so... Why wouldn't y'all put that? Whatever. And then, oh, I'll be so mad if this is the wrong one. Oh, no. This is. What? Okay. Anyways. These are my black ribbons that I'm going to put on the outside of my small boxes and my large boxes. My large boxes hasn't came in yet, but when they do, I might do a, um, I might do an unboxing for that, that stuff. That still has to come. Okay, we have another box. So here are my um, lip gloss labels, some confetti for my, oh wait, <laughs> some confetti for my boxes, and I was excited about these. These are some, I might actually have to put it in my hand to show you, but I don't know if you can see. I am, listen y'all. I am ashy. I feel it. So, don't judge me. I am ashy. Don't judge me. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking what I have to put a picture. Because I don't think I can do it. But, these are like little diamonds. 
little fake diamond that I ordered. And it came with a little um pouch. A little like a little velvet pouch. I'm gonna show you guys what that is for um later. I did not <laughs> expect this to be this size, but this is a big bag of crinkle paper for packaging. I did not expect it to be that size at all. So that means that's gonna last a pretty long time. This box is full of stuff from Walmart and Dollar Tree. Y'all, I went to Dollar Tree and I cashed out. Not really. <laughs> Not really. I spent like 40 something dollars, but that is ridiculous to spend in Dollar Tree. Like, that is extremely ridiculous. Um, I've never spent that money, <laughs> that much money in Dollar Tree. Like, Dollar Tree? Okay. So, I got some mixing spoons, which, you know, you know, you know. Plastic bowls. These, this stuff right here, the, all the stuff from Dollar Tree and stuff, this is for my lip gloss. Yeah, cause ain't, basically everything I'm ordering now is for my lip gloss and for my other stuff that I'm launching because I have everything for my lashes. Rules eyes, I have everything for my lashes, I'm not. Stay tuned for my next video for you to understand why I'm not excited. Ugh. I already opened this, but Ziploc bags, um, I don't even know why I got these, because even before I went to the store, I already said that I wanted to only use containers to mix my glosses in, so that I can already have it stored, um, something with a lid, and then, you know, just put it away, uh, and I just really don't want to use the plastic bowls but I think for like my practice colors and stuff like that and practice um, stuff I'll use I mean like when I'm trying new or like when I'm trying new um, colors on and stuff I'll probably use the bowl but not for um, I don't know if I'll use it for that Every time I am recording, that phone rings. Every time. Anyways, here are plastic spoons. I don't know the essentials from Dollar Tree. Nothing special. I got some more sticky notes. Because I use a lot of sticky notes um, in my pad. Like my notepad when I write down stuff. Tape. I have more I bought a lot of containers from Dollar Tree. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Spatula. They need to restock by the way. I got these little ones. I promise you I probably won't even use them, but they're so cute. Like I have a problem, I know. Um I got some little zip up bags. I don't even know what I'm using this for. But better to have it since it needed to not have it. Um, more Ziploc bags. I'm going to show you my lash boxes. My lash boxes finally arrived, as well as my additional lashes. Um, but I'm going to show you my guys my lash boxes. These are my lash boxes. Uh, <sighs> This is the back. Inside. One of my natural lashes. Okay. I have. I am not excited about my lashes. I'm not excited about my boxes at all. Um, But my next video I will be talking about. My lashes and everything. So I just wanted to show you guys the actual box. But 
in my next video, I will show you everything. Like my lashes. I'll go over the nails with you. Tell you the little story that happened with my vendor. Um, yeah, so this is all the stuff that I have now. Um, again, I don't have a, a definitive launch date. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna get it together. I am. I'm gonna launch. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a launch. Um, my launch date is gonna be soon. I don't know how soon, but again, on all my videos, I will come back. And on all my entrepreneur series videos and entrepreneur vlogs, I will come back and pin the comment for my um, launch date, and I will have it in all my description boxes. Follow my social media, um, my business social media is Pretty and Ruthless on IG, um, Pretty underscore and underscore Ruthless on IG. Everything is linked below. I will have everything on the screen. My business Facebook like page is Pretty and Ruthless, no underscores, no spaces, nothing else. Um, my website is finished i just haven't published it yet um but that is www.prettyandreplace.com um uh, <laughs> what else oh my personal instagram my makeup instagram all of that and one is bratty underscore puffs follow me on facebook at milani t kente i will be doing a giveaway um for my launch so make sure you hit the notification bell and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any details or any more of my videos like comment and subscribe share my video if you have a business if you're starting a business and any of that leave your website and your instagram in the comments so i can check you guys out thanks for watching my video i'll see you guys soon bye